The following video will assist you with setting up Guarding Expert on your mobile device. It is important to note that we already have ports forwarded and are using a DDNS service in this example. This will require additional steps, so please feel free to contact technical support for any assistance with that. Once you open up the app, it will bring you to the Live View page. To add a device, you're simply going to go to Devices and select the plus icon on the upper right hand corner and select Manual Adding. Here you're going to give your device a name. This is going to be our home setting, which will be our local IP address. So you use home, register mode will be IP domain, and we're using a local IP address of 192.168.1.146. And the default port is 8000. In this example, we're using a custom port that is 6036. and go ahead and enter your username and password and then select the save icon on the upper right hand corner so that is the home setting to use when you're at the location of the recorder or camera on Wi-Fi and now we're going to add an away setting so we'll go back to devices select the plus icon again Again, select Manual Adding. This will be our Away setting. And we're using a domain, so this is something that you can set up yourself or feel free to contact technical support uh, with assistance with setting that up. Uh, you can also use your public IP address. Okay, and we, we are using our custom port again here. It's the same information as the home setting, except the address is going to be different. We'll just enter our username and password, and then we'll select the save icon again at the upper right hand corner. Okay, and if you're on Wi Fi, you want to make sure you disable that or turn that off when you're using the away setting when you're at the location. So I just went and did that. I turned off my Wi-Fi. Um, you see it failed for me the first time, but now that I turned it off, here we go. And we'll try it one more time. And keep in mind, you might have to give it a minute or two uh, for it to connect. So I'm just gonna go in there and uncheck and recheck my away setting. And here we have our live camera in real time. Okay, you have different layouts here, one channel, four channel, nine channel, and a 16 channel. And you also have your custom video stream settings here. All right, so you can customize the stream any way you'd like and it will reflect your rec recording quality, uh, so just keep that in mind. Okay, you also have your PTZ controls. If this was a PTZ camera, you'll be able to use your finger to swipe up, down, left, and right. Uh, but this example was not a PTZ camera. And the camera icon to the left of the PTZ icon will actually let you save live footage directly to your phone. To get to the footage, click the icon on the upper left-hand corner and select picture and video. That'll take you directly to those files. Okay, now we're going to move on to remote playback. So once you get to that screen, hit the plus on one of the empty boxes and now enter your time parameters for what you'd want to search for. Once you're done entering your parameters, just go ahead and tap your finger on two or select back on the bottom left hand corner. Now we're going to select our camera. We'll choose camera one. Okay, 
And now we can see our footage that is on the 4 a.m. mark. And you could use your fingers to slide back and forth. All right, and now the scissor icon there will actually let you download and back up this footage directly to your phone. Okay, so you just select the scissor icon, let the footage play, and then uncheck the scissor icon and it'll save directly to your phone. To get to the video file, select the icon on the upper left hand corner and go to picture and video. I'll just go ahead and select the file and tap on the play button. Okay, one last thing I wanted to go over in this video was actually under live view and you're going to select the icon on the upper right hand corner. This will list the devices you have on your app. So if you're home, you'll choose home. If you're away from home, you'll choose away. Thank you so much for watching.